And now we join Fleet Corps other infomercial in an infomercial roll call calculator. Anyway, um, so what happened, as I was previously saying before we was in okay, the room, okay. um, like, yeah, he told me everything was going to be okay. Um, I set it up perfectly, got the cars out to him, and they actually went ahead and spiked early for me, so I thought everything was just fine with them, and they were going to go ahead and do what they were supposed to. Okay. Um, then, you know, of course, I look at Fleetnet, and I notice uh, I didn't get a couple of, uh, you know, a couple swipes one week, so I call them to try to figure out what's really going on, and at this point in time, they notify me that they actually have on-site tanks. Wow. Uh, now, I, of course, I asked them how they were fueling. They told me what fuel car they were using. Uh, the on-site tanks thing didn't come up until just now. Okay, so in your initial call with your customer, you didn't ask them about on-site on -site tanks? You didn't? Well, when I initially started talking about a fleet car, they told me they were using. So I went ahead with uh, what they were using and actually tried to break it down and give them something that they could use. Okay. Um, I, they didn't notify me that there was an on-site tank in the situation. Okay, so here we go. Let's, let's talk numbers for a second, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. This particular account was doing about 5,000 a week, right? Okay, they were doing about 5,000 a week, about 20,000 a month, right? Let me ask you, do you typically, because I'm noticing that you typically, you're pretty on point when it comes to your accounts. Mm -hmm. So this was alarming for me, okay? Mm -hmm. So are you typically conservative or, or not when you're roll call? Well, you know, usually, usually I try to do the roll call kind of conservative thing. Okay. Um, but it was a stretch this month, really was trying to make my number. So I figured I could depend on them to do what they said they were going to do. Improper roll calling can lead to indigestion, chronic halitosis, intolerable gas, involuntary bowel movements, diabetes, stroke, heart attack, and dizziness. So this is their true roll call, which is about 44 vehicles, right? Mm-hmm. So 60% of that should have been 27. Correct, correct. Uh, but once again, though, I initially tried to set this account up for 20000 a month. Right, right. Okay. So what, what wind up happening is they only did the 5000 a month. Because they have on-site tanks. Correct, correct. Now, if, hey, listen, I told them that we need them to use these cards. Okay. I don't know why these people be lying. Well, I don't know if it's them lying or not. They just didn't explain to you everything, you know, the way that they were really doing their business. Right, right. right. And then I actually tried to explain to them that, hey, maybe we could actually utilize the car to purchase some of that on-site fuel. <laughs> they were unwilling to do that. So you knew about the on-site tank? No, this was that. Wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm just saying. No, this office. was after I found out. If I had a note about this from the jump shot, I need all the gallons too. Don't you think I like getting paid? I have huh? I'm just honest. I'm dealing with a short check too. Right, I understand, but now it's going to be even shorter. You understand what I'm saying? Uh, can we make the conversation a little shorter? Because I don't apologize. I don't know what else I can do about them lying. <laughs> Fleet Corps, where understanding your tools keeps you from being one.